Hi guys, welcome back. I have another song cover for you today and I hope you enjoy. I'm going away for a while, but I'll be back. Don't try and follow me. Cause I'll return as soon as possible Cause see I'm trying to find my place But it might not be here where I feel safe We all learn to make mistakes And run from them From them With no direction We run from them From them With no conviction Cause I'm just one of those ghosts Traveling endlessly Don't need no roads In fact they follow me And we just go in circles But now I'm told that this is life And pain is just a simple compromise So we can get what we want out of it Would someone care to classify Our broken hearts and twisted minds So I can find someone to rely on And run to them, to them Full speed ahead Oh, you are not useless We are just misguided ghosts Traveling endlessly The ones we trusted the most Pushed us far away and there's no one road And we should not be the same But I'm just a ghost And still they echo me They echo me in circles All right, so I really wanted to do this song, Misguided Ghosts by Paramore. It's a very poetic song, like most songs. Also, like most songs, it can be interpreted multiple ways. And I do wanna take a second to gush about Haley Williams, other than her just incredible voice. She also has this wonderful way in her art, in her music. She has meow. We have a little guest star. Another fan of Haley Williams. But yeah, she just has this beautiful way of conveying and showing pain. I know she has said in the past that she's not the most eloquent speaker. She doesn't do well talking, but she's the exact opposite when it comes to her music. She can get across a feeling, a message, and she does it so well. Now, this song is from their album, Brand New Eyes, but I am going to reference one of my favorite albums, After Laughter, where it's a great example of her musicality and her songwriting. That entire album sounds like it's 80s funky pop music. Meow, come here. Come here if you want to join. You have a beautiful voice. The album After Laughter, it has such an 80s funk pop kind of a feel to it. But when you dig deep into the lyrics, listening to the music, you would have no idea how painful they are. I think she's just such a brilliant artist. I love the band in general. I did do a light look at the lyrics of this song. I am just kind of doing a very rough overview. I'm sure there's so many layers you can peel back and really delve and dive into this song. I think I've said this before, but I love it when more rock bands and pop bands that are usually like poppy and vibrant, when they release songs like this, a little bit more slow, acoustic, gentle, just because I think it makes them that much more powerful. This hauntingly beautiful piece 
I think is mostly about trauma and the patterns and cycles that we find ourselves falling into, basically repeating the same mistakes over and over again. And I want to talk about that because when I was in college, I had this amazing mentor when I was studying theater. As an artist, we are told that we have to deal with our stuff. We have to deal with the past. We have to deal with the things that bears weight on our shoulders because we can't fully express until we fully heal. One of the things that she had told me was we are doomed to repeat the same mistakes over and over again until we learn from them. When we finally learn our lesson, then we are given that freedom, that breath of fresh air, that new start. What I love about this song is that it's not an angry song. It's not even a feel bad for me song. It's very much a resolve. It's an acceptance of this is where I'm at right now and maybe one day I'll find my way out of this vicious cycle. No longer be a misguided ghost but maybe be a guided ghost. Eventually after healing be whole again. I don't know, I think angry songs are super easy. Anger is the easiest emotion, at least that's what we're taught in theater. For this to be more of like it's not apologetic, but it's also not pointing a finger at anyone or anything. It's past the point of all that. It just is what it is. The part of the song where it talks about, I'm just told that this is life and pain is just a simple compromise. It kind of made me think of the whole move on, get over it mindset, which when you are in the midst of these traumas, these burdens, it's not as easy as all that. It takes a lot of hard work. You have to look in on yourself, categorize, okay, the things that you're doing wrong and the issues that you need to work on, but also analyze what you deserve in life. Allowing yourself to believe that you deserve better and that you can do better and things will get better. It also allows us when we go through certain times that we can be more understanding to others. We gain wisdom from that. It's easier to be a little bit more empathetic that you don't know what's going on in someone's personal life, what their emotions are that they're holding on to. So it's good to just bear in mind, spread a little joy, spread some light in the world. Which is a great segue to a part in the song where she starts off and it's very personal. I'm just a ghost. It's me. This is what I'm going through. And then all of a sudden it switches. It switches gears and it talks about we. It's more of group mindset, solidarity, that it's not just me. It's people. There's a lot of us out here that kind of go through this. She just transforms it from personal to an expression of a group as a whole. That specific switch I think is the best form of showing that there's hope. Instead of endlessly and listlessly wandering, we can eventually go full speed ahead because we are all in this together and pain is a not so gentle reminder that we are alive and living, being alive is encouragement to grow, to learn while we still can. Grow to be the best versions of ourselves and help other people do the exact same thing. Even though it's my interpretation of this song, <laughs> I like it. I think it makes a lot of sense. I think it's bigger than just feel sorry for me sad song. I think anything that we listen to like that, put a motivational spin on it and find that light. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you enjoyed the song cover. If you have any other suggestions for me, write them down in the comments below. Don't forget to hit the thumbs up. I'll see you guys next time. Stay happy, stay healthy, stay bright. Bye.